Hi all folks, this is Max from NexusSHacks.com So I've got a new ROM review for um, the Nexus S4G on my left and the regular Nexus S on my right um, So this is the code name ROM for both, it's available for both And uh, I've got both running at uh, 1.46 GHz overclocked um, Let me just put one of them down, I'll show you on my Nexus S4G It's just pretty much the same thing um, under system settings you'll find um, the code name settings you can see interface performance and launcher um, let's take a look at the performance part and uh, go to processor speed and you can see I've got it set at 1.46 gigahertz governors um, I think the matrix kernel is the best um, interactive X I like that one the best for so far but I put it on performance mode right now uh, and let me adjust the maximum frequency. Sometimes you you have to make sure it's at 1.46 for just testing. Um, so I'll give you a quadrant performance. This is actually the best performing Nexus S combo ROM slash kernel combo that I've tried. Um, so highly recommend it. And also this is actually recommended to me by MathKit95, the developer of Matrix Kernel. Um, also... Let me show you on the uh, next. Well, it's the same thing. It also works really well on one, uh, overclocked to 1.46 gigahertz. Some phones may not be able to go that far, but you know, both of my phones are actually overclocked to 1.46 gigahertz. So yeah, if you can do it, that's good. If you can't, that's too bad. You might want to try like 1.3 or 1.2. Um, but my phone is running like super fast now, super smooth. Um, I really like this ROM actually like it better than Crossbones and Bixie so um, for those of you who've been waiting you might want to check it out um, so I've got 2490 there and uh, let me adjust the make it a little brighter so it's easier to see I was getting almost 3000 earlier so I was like wow this seems so fast um, so you can go to system settings performance again and uh, processor speed don't set up performance, that's if you're just playing games all day long. Um, Interactive X is, I think, good for great performance. And also, um, you, you, you want to put it on set on boot, right? And then let me show you some of the other features. Um, like, you can, you can, you'll notice that I've got my own carrier, Zito Max. Um, and also you have the, uh, for the Nexus S 4G, you have the 4G toggle, which is really great for toggling easily to 4G. That's an interface where you can change all that. Um, you can change the notification widget. I really like how the codename ROM, it's, everything's in settings, it's not in a different app. You don't need to install another app, and also it's kind of very clean ROM. Um, so this is actually my first time trying it. Rotation and animation. Um, you can enable the 180 degrees so you can use it um, this way too, which is great. But I lost my button, so I'm gonna go back this way. And let me see here. Let's do. Oh, there we go. The custom carrier label is pretty cool, so I changed it to Zedon X. Um, so you can get your own, you know, whatever there. And uh, let me show you launcher options you can change the home screen options um, number of home screens I've got it at five default home screen number of rows you can change I've got it also at five columns at five um, you can get rid of the search bar I haven't on this one because I haven't done it yet but I'll show you actually on the regular Nexus S so you'll see the change um, it's just a little customization but some of you might like it because like for me, I don't I don't want that search bar there because I don't I don't really use it. So if I go to home now, the search bar is gone, and uh, let me see if you can tell a difference here. Okay, well, other than that, it's a standard um, Android 4.0.3 and uh, system settings about phone um, 4.0.3. I guess this is one of the best ROMs out there right now, and also the kernel, um, you know, so it, it's a really good combo. I think I've actually found a new, even a new combo. I like the Crossbones Big C, and now 
I like this one too. So highly recommend it uh, for you to for you guys to try it out. Let me know what you think, and uh, let me sh let me set up screen lock real quick and show you that it's working good. Actually, you know what? Uh, screen lock isn't working as well as the crossbones. I'm not sure if it's the lighting. I'm at, over at my parents' house, but I'm not going to go into that one because um, that's not the real feature. Um, but everything else is like really smooth, and uh, I really like it. The progress of you know ICS on Nexus S is probably the best right now. Um, oops. No, I don't want to go there. Um, anyway, I just wanted to show you. Uh, let's see Google News real quick. Um, this new ROM combo works really well. It's actually been recommended. Um, I've been actually looking for a good combo and it works really well. What I really like is that out of the box, I don't have to do anything and it overclocks to 1.4 gigahertz. I haven't had a um, single freeze for like last eight hours I've been using this. Um, so I really love this ROM. Check it out. Um, I know you guys are going to love it and ICS just keeps getting better and better on the Nexus S. I would say it's probably one of the best implemented. Maybe that's not a uh, surprise since you know it's it's a nexus phone so but it, nexus is still my one of my favorite device um if i feel like my galaxy nexus or galaxy note is too big for example i'm going somewhere and you know i i'm gonna go like clubbing or something or you know then i'll take my nexus s or you know it's still a great phone um you know the coolest part is there's a lot of the rom developers and a lot of kernel developers great kernels um, so right now I would say the top of the line is the um, the Big C Apex kernel or the ROM the crossbones I really like and also this one is the new one and I think code name is the new really good one so I mean they're, they're all a little bit different so um, depending on what you like you might like it a lot but I really like this one because um, I can put Zero Max on the on there and also on my my um, lock screen there it's kind of cool <laughs> anyway um this is a really good rom check it out let me know what you think um post comments on youtube or on my site nexusshacks.com and check out uh, uh matrix kernels new site i helped to make it it's called the matrix kernels.com you can get the kernels there i'll have a link to his kernel site download the latest version of uh, version um version 16 that's what i'm using and I think he's going to come out with a 16.5 6 and 16.54. He just told me to, um, oh, he's just, he's going to send me a beta version of it so I can test it out also. So I'll have an update on that. Um, but check it out. Really great combos. Um, codename, codename ROM and the uh, Matrix Kernel. Freaking highly recommend it. Oh, yeah. See y'all later. All right. Subscribe.